there and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Azalea and today I am going to finally be doing the last video on the Profusion Festival palette. I will be going into the seventh column and it will be the last one. So I know that the shades at the ver at the last and more towards the beginning are a bit more neutral, so I went with a neutral top for doing this video. After I'm done doing this, I will give my final thoughts on what I think overall of the palette. The makeup that I will be using will be listed in the description box. You will also be able to find all of my social medias where you can feel free to follow me on there. Also, feel free to leave a comment down below. I have already done my eyebrows and I have already primed my eyelids with my Milani eyeshadow primer. So that's the finished eye look. I will say that what appears to be a black in the <laughs> very bottom right hand corner when you're actually looking at the palette, this one here, it does look like a black in person, but when it's applied to the eyes, it's more of a charcoal gray. That doesn't really bother me, but I don't know if that might bother you. This one here, I had fallout on my face with. If I did have any with this one, I don't see it. All in all, I do like this palette. And if I remember correctly, I think that it was the middle rows that I didn't care for, the pinks and purples. The blues worked out a lot better than their sapphires palette. If you feel that you may end up picking this up and playing around with it yourself, please let me know and let me know how everything ends up working out for you. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope that you have a wonderful day today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you like this content and you want to see more, and then make sure you hit the notification bell and turn notifications on to all so is that way you get notified every time I upload a new video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!